hello hello welcome to the vlog i guess um i made some coffee i'm going to get some work done i um are dissociating um i woke up this morning took a shower i did my skincare my skin still feels a bit tight though um which is weird because it feels it only feels tight like in my chin area and i'm using a gel moisturizer in the mornings and i added a bit of oil to it so i don't know but um did my skincare made some coffee took a shower so i feel like ready to go i don't know if i'm gonna put on any makeup today i don't think so um just because the plans that i did have today um i had to get like rescheduled because i have so much work i need to do so <clears throat> didn't really yeah don't really have any plans to leave the house yet again so yeah this is what we're doing um okay so i'm gonna play some music just have a really chill morning working that's the vibe see you later oh my god <laughs> what the fuck jamie you literally knew that that was gonna happen too no The sinking ship is burning, so let go of my hands. How can I give you all of me when I don't love who I am? You know, I used to hate eating cakes because. I used to hate eating eggs because my stepdad would, wow, why do I look so red? Um, I used to hate eating eggs growing up because my stepdad used to just like make eggs all the time for us as snacks and I get it now because it's like an easy go-to snack but um, just like traumatized me a bit because I was like forced to eat my eggs as well so yeah didn't really like them growing up but now I love eggs I love adding eggs to like like I don't mind eggs I don't love them I'm still like a bit traumatized but I don't mind eating them as much now hmm. this lighting is really good the LED lights are on for the planter which I should show you Cute, hey? We got some green onions. Shakira, I think, is passing away. This is an aloe plant. Cacti, which I also think is dying. Like, I don't know. Oh, it feels very soft. Like, I don't know, like, how to revive her. And these are just clippings. And then this is a plant that we got that was actually in Brittany's spot. So this is our, this is Brittany. She hangs here. It will focus. Um, that's Brittany. She hangs out there. And that one was younger Brittany. And younger Brittany like was dying in that, in that spot there. So you know what we did? We tried to revive her. Parts of Brittany didn't make it. You know, she's she's chilling. We're trying to be good plant parents. It's not working out in our favor right now. Also, I think the way I'm gonna structure the vlogs for right now is that I am going to, um, I think I'm going to post like an updated, like kind of like an up to date vlog next to an old video so like one week will be like so i'm thinking this week 
I'll post a Cambridge Bay video tomorrow. So that would be from like May of last year. And then I'll post this video like on Saturday or something. So it's like more like updated like in my life. But um, yeah, I think that's how I'm gonna structure it. Like one older video and then one updated video until the old videos run out. And then it'll just be updated weekly videos for the most part. I don't know, but. Also, these are the plants we repotted. And then those are also repotted plants. They need some water, so just need some love. Okay, so I'm going to eat my food, listen to the podcast I was listening to, and then get back to work. We're almost done. I'm so excited to finally get this off of my workload. But I will talk to you later. It just became super foggy out. Wow. Can't see anything. Hi. Your girl is struggling with her mental health and it's like getting pretty bad. And I'm not gonna lie, I, you know, I'm not okay. I'm struggling in, in so many aspects of my life that it, it just feels like everything around me is like crashing down literally and it just feels like I feel I feel really dark and heavy right now and I'm trying really hard to to not be in this in this head space and I'm trying really hard to you know wake up every day with positive thoughts and just you know with positive intentions but that's not realistic for me right now and you know It's been really hard. Like I feel like I make other people's lives miserable. And I feel like a burden. And I feel like I would make other people's lives easier if I wasn't in it. <clears throat> At like any capacity you know and i and i think right now i'm very much in that like stage of like pushing people away i feel like i'm distancing myself from like everyone And I just like, I don't feel okay, you know? And I just feel so like heavy and dark. But like, I know it's gonna be okay because I've been through this before. But it's hard when you feel like you have like nobody to lean on. Like, I'm surrounded by friends you know all the time and this is probably the most I've been surrounded by like people and this is the most I've ever felt like alone 
think this is the loneliest I, I've ever felt in my entire life and it sucks. Yeah, we're not okay. We're struggling a little bit here. And I don't know what the purpose is of adding this in. But just that I think I feel like it's not fair to me to not add it in or at least fair to future Jamie because this I do want to document like truly the highs and the lows and this is the low and I'm exhausted I'm tired of feeling this way And I'm sure like moving forward, it might cause confusion because you might see me doing things and you might be like, oh, she's happy. <laughs> um, but just know like everyone wears a mask that they don't, like everyone has a mask that they don't take off. And I don't know why I'm being vulnerable, especially on the internet. I think it's, it feels easiest to me to say these things to a camera into people that I know like are either my friends or not my friends or total strangers but just like out in the public that that feels comfortable to me it makes me feel uncomfortable um makes me feel uncomfortable with the idea of like talking to another human like right in front of me um, but it, like, for whatever reason, this doesn't make me feel uncomfortable. So I don't know what that means. I don't know, like, <clears throat> I don't know. But I just know, like, I want, like, my socials to be a place that people find genuine joy in. And, like, they find, like, some positive aspects in. I, I don't want this to always be like, I'm struggling with my mental health all the time. <laughs> like, because it's not always like that. At least in my everyday life, I don't think. And it's just been a really hard time lately. And, and I think with this creative outlet, I, you know, am adopting in my life, aka YouTube and like the podcast and all of this stuff. I feel like that's really gonna help in some ways, like for me to stay creative. Yeah, in conclusion, we're struggling. Didn't finish the vlog yesterday because we had a really bad mental health evening. And when I get like this, yeah, when I get like, and this is just like to my friends, you know, to my family, to people like closest to me, like I don't mean to push you away. And I don't mean, like, it's not my intention to, like, ignore you. It's, it's just, it's hard for me to, like, have to explain myself. Or, like, it's hard for me to have to, like, deal with the idea of having to explain what's happening with me. Or, like, to explain what's wrong or whatever. And it's not fair to you guys that... I do this and I don't mean to and I and I want to work on it but I just know that I love you and yeah anyways I'm going to end the vlog here thanks for listening if you've listened um I appreciate it and I know everything's gonna be okay we're gonna be okay we're gonna thrive. It's gonna be a positive. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We're good. Um, but I did just wanna put that out there and say that. So I appreciate you if you listened. 
and I love you. I love you so much. I'll see you in the next video.